guys, my name is Sheila and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, hindi muna tayo mag grammar lesson kasi there was a suggestion from my high school teacher, English teacher, Mrs. Agida Yap, na mag-pronunciation daw muna ako kasi nga, boring na daw yung grammar. <laughs> oh, boring na, napoport na si mom. <laughs> Okay, anyway, and then, by the way, before we go on sa ating pronunciation lesson, guys, please, please lang, okay? Tapusin nyo munang panoorin itong video na to, itong pronunciation video na to, before kayo mag-like, mag-comment, or mag-subscribe. Otherwise, pare-pareho tayong malalagasan ni Lolo. Alam nyo na ngayon, si Lolo, panay ang... You know, panay ang pag... Ano yung tawag din yun? Yung, yung panlalagas niya ng, ng mga saging. Kaya please guys, okay? Hindi na ako maalis-alis sa 188. Ano ba <laughs> Okay, anyway. So as I've said, na we're gonna have pronunciation lesson today. And our topic is... English words commonly mispronounced by many Filipinos. Yes, you heard it right. There are actually a lot of English words that many Filipinos, including me, might have been mispronouncing all this time. All this time. All this time. All this time. Mali pala pronunciation natin. Pero okay lang. Kasi there's a lot of room for, I mean, there's a lot of room for improvement naman, di ba? So for today, let's just focus on words that begin with letter A. Alright, so if you're ready, let's start with our first word. Alright, so our first word is, oh, ayan, papano magpronounce niyan? Hmm? Sige nga, okay? It's actually a baloney. Abalone. Abalone. Okay? Hindi siya yung pinupronounce ng iba na abalone. Okay? Mali po yun. Hindi po abalone. It's abalone. Abalone. Okay? Abalone is a small sea creature that can be eaten. It lives inside a shell that is the shape of an ear and it's white and shiny inside. For example... My favorite seafood is abalone, abalone, abalone. Our second word is very common. Sige nga, how do you pronounce this word? Hmm? It's actually accessory, accessory, accessory. Hindi accessory, all right? Sorry, it's not accessory. A person is guilty of being an accessory to the crime when he helped someone who committed it, or he definitely knew it was being committed but did not report the matter to the authority. For example, Tina was arrested for being an accessory to the murder done by her husband. Our third word is also very common. Okay, how do you pronounce this word? It's acknowledge. 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 Hindi siya acknowledge. Okay? Alright? It's acknowledge. You acknowledge a fact or a situation when you accept or admit that it is true or that it exists. For example, the president acknowledged the existence of drug problems in the country. Acknowledge. Our fourth word is... Yung mga mahilig sa gitara, mm, alam nyo to, alright? It's acoustic, acoustic, hindi siya acoustic, alright? No, 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 it's not acoustic, it's acoustic, okay? Acoustic is used to refer to a musical instrument that is not made louder by electrical equipment. Acoustic, acoustic, acoustic. Our next word is, mm -hmm, let's see, kung alam nyo mag-pronounce nito. It's admirable. 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 Hindi siya, ano, yung naririnig ko sa iba na admirable or admirable. Hindi po ganun. It's admirable. Admirable. 
it means deserving respect or approval. For example, the airport security did an admirable job in keeping the people calm. Our next word refers to the teenagers. All right, yung mga nagbibinata at yung nag nagdadalaga. All right, it's adolescence, 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 not adolescence. Okay, hindi po siya adolescence. It's adolescence. It's the period of time in a person's life when he or she is developing into an adult. Adolescence. Okay, for example, Sheena had a troubled adolescence. Adolescence. Next word, mm, kilala mga beauty queen dito. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's, oh, ano tawag dyan? <laughs> okay, it's advocacy. 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 Hindi an advocacy, okay? It's not, okay? Advocacy means a public support or an idea, plan, or way of doing something. For example, Catriona Gray is known for her advocacy of helping the poor children in the slums of Tondo, Manila. Advocacy. Advocacy. Hmm? Our next word refers to some legal matters. Okay? Uh, kapag may mga legal na document na nawawala, kailangan natin ito. O ano magpronounce dyan? It's affidavit. Affidavit. Affidavit, okay? Hindi siya affidavit, alright? Kagaya sa naririnig ko sa iba, marami akong naririnig na affidavit daw, okay? An affidavit is a written statement that someone makes after promising officially to tell the truth. For example, I can use this affidavit as proof in the court. Affidavit, affidavit, affidavit. Uy! Andyan pa ba kayo? <laughs> Huwag kayong mag-skip. Patapusin nyo na to. Number nine word na tayo. Okay? Oh, how do you pronounce this word? Hmm? It's allegedly. 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 Hindi siya allegedly. Okay? It's used when something illegal or wrong is said to have been done but has not been proved. Okay, so for example, Ben was arrested for allegedly involved in kidnapping a businessman's wife. Allegedly. 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 Our number 10 word is magaling daw to or maganda daw to sa puso. Kaya kung broken hearted ka, kumain ka ng marami nito. Okay, alam nyo na ba kung ano itong anong number 10 word? It's ano? Paano i-pronounce yan? Hmm? It's amond. Amond. Sa UK pronunciation yan, amond. Pero sa American English, it's almond. 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 Hmm? Pero hindi siya almond. Hindi po almond. It's almond or almond. An edible oval nut with a hard shell or the tree that it grows on. For example, my mom told me that almonds are good for the heart. Almonds. All right, we are now in number 11. Kaya, hawak kamay, wag nyo kong iiwan sa vlog na to. Oh, ano yung number 11 word? Hmm? It's alms. 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 Hindi po siya alms. Wala pong alms. Wala pong uh na sound. It's alms. Okay? It, it's some clothing or food or money that is given to the poor and the needy. Alms. For example, my grandparents thought that it's a religious duty to give alms to the needy. Alms. Number 12 word. Oh, actually, alam nyo to. Hmm, alam na alam nyo to. Oh, kung saan kayo na graduate? Anong tawag sa inyo? It's alumni. 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 Hindi siya alumni. Okay? Hindi siya alumni. And a female who graduated in a particular school or university. 
For example, I am an alumni of West Negros College. Alumni, alumni, alumni. Oh, ang number 13 word natin ay tinitake nyo to, iniinom nyo to na gamot kapag may masakit sa katawan ninyo. Oh, ano tawag nyo dyan? Or anong pagpronounce nyo dyan? It's analgesic. 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 Hindi siya analgesic. Okay? Hindi siya analgesic. It's analgesic. Gesic. Okay? It is a type of drug that relieves pain. Analgesic. For example, paracetamol is one of the most commonly used analgesics in the Philippines. Analgesic. Analgesic. Mm. Our number 14 word is usually mispronounced. Three-letter word lang to, pero madalas na ni mispronounced. Anong pagpronounce yung dito sa three-letter word na to? Hmm? It's any. 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 Any, any, any. It's not any. Hindi po siya any. Okay? It means the sum or even the smallest amount or number of. For example, there wasn't any food left to eat by the time we arrived there. Any. 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 Hmm. Andiyan pa ba kayo? Huwag kayong mag-skip. Malapit nang matapos to. Nasa number 15 na tayo. Please lang. Huwag kayong umalis. Alright? Our number 15 word is appreciate. Appreciate. I-appreciate nyo naman ako. Hindi appreciate. Okay? It's not appreciate. It's appreciate. To connect someone or something in your mind with someone or something else. For example, you should buy her some flowers for sure. She definitely appreciate it. Number 16 word. Okay, malapit na matapos. Just stay with me. Okay, how do you pronounce this word? It's associate. 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 Hindi siya associate. Okay, it's not associate, it's associate. All right, it means to recognize how good someone or something is and to value him, her, or it. For example, the most, most consumers associate brands with good quality. And you kayo, our next 17 word. How do you pronounce that? It's asthma. Asthma. For the US, sa UK naman, it's asthma. Asthma. But hindi siya asthma. Okay? Note. A medical condition that makes breathing difficult by causing the air passages to become narrow or blocked. For example, he just had an asthma or asthma attack. Our number 18 word is Papan ba yan? Ano yan? Papan ay pronounce yan? It's allergy. 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 Hindi siya allergy. Okay? Not allergy. A condition that makes a person become sick or develop skin or breathing problems because they have eaten certain foods. Allergy. For example, my rash is caused by an allergy to seafood. 19 na, 19 na, number 19 na. How do you pronounce this word? Hmm. It's attorney for the U.S. Attorney, attorney, attorney. But for the U.K., for the British English, they say attorney, attorney, but not attorney. Hindi po siya attorney. Ang corny mo, ha? Ang corny, corny mo. Okay? Attorney or attorney is how you call a lawyer. For example, attorney Garcia is our lawyer for this case. Attorney or attorney. Hmm, 
20 na. This is our last word. Okay? Andiyan pa ba kayo? Please stay. Malapit na itong matapos. Okay? Please. It's... Oh, how do you pronounce this word? It's a wordy. A wordy. A wordy. It's not a wordy. It's not a wordy. Okay? It's a wordy. A person who is given money, a prize, etc. by an official organization. For example, the president himself presented the award to the awardee. Finally, let's just have a quick review of those 20 words commonly mispronounced by many Filipinos. Alright, so number one, a baloney, a baloney, a baloney. Accessory, accessory, accessory. Acknowledge, acknowledge, acknowledge. Acoustic, acoustic, acoustic. Admirable, admirable, admirable. Adolescence, adolescence, adolescence. Advocacy, advocacy, advocacy. Affidavit, affidavit, affidavit. Allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. Almond. Almond, almond, arms, 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 alumni, 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 analgesic, 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 any, any, any. Appreciate, appreciate, appreciate. Associate, associate, associate. Asthma, asthma, asthma. Allergy, allergy, allergy. Attorney, attorney, attorney. Awardee, awardee, awardee. So that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the black notification bell for more videos. And give it a thumb up as well. Thank you. God bless. See you next time. Bye.